Hello. So today, I'm going to be going over top five celebrities that you may or may not have known that play CSGO. So first off, I just want to say these are five celebrities from all over the world. As this first one is from Brazil, there's one from Sweden, some from the US. We're all going to be able to go over them and look at their inventories see what kind of you know dough they're racking in. First off we're going to start with Neymar which is by far the most popular with 147 million followers on Instagram. So as you can see is a $54,000 inventory. And let's see when he was last active. It's tradable so he hasn't bought anything new within a week but he has been active in the last two weeks because he has some RMR stickers and these came out two three weeks ago so he has been active and he has <laughs> he does have a howl a ten thousand dollar howl I mean that's a fifth of his inventory look at that I'm not quite sure what the name means maybe it's you know something special for him he's got a Panthera Anka so you know he's getting invested in the operation he's been too busy with uh, soccer so he hasn't been able to upgrade his coin properly but he uh, I, I think he might be able to get it up I mean he acquired it December 4th <laughs> it's, uh, it's February so he might may or may not get it up he's a neo noir so as you can tell he does spend quite a bit of money on this game, Hot Rod, Bullet Queen, Vogue, Gungnir, $5,500, Ooh, look at that, it's even got a, uh, a sticker, a Dragon Lore foil on the scope, well, that'll add a little bit, probably like 20 30 bucks, but the overall the sticker isn't worth that much. Uh, oh, and uh, I think the series was like 15 bucks, you know. But he's got a discotheque. It's kind of new. You see he was here by the sh for the Shattered Web. Or at least he has some stickers for it. He's got a few pins. He has Shattered Web Pass. There we go. Ooh, look at that. Fuel Injector. 633 kills. Stat track. $800 skin. I mean, I don't know how active he plays. I'm assuming he doesn't play much because, you know, he plays basketball. He also plays with MIBR and SK Gaming, which, if you don't know, are professional CSGO teams. I do, I do like MIBR, or at least I used to, but they broke up their roster, so I do not like them anymore. But Yes, they got a case. Harden doesn't seem like it's worth that much. 300 kills. You got a dragon lore. Is that a souvenir or no? Yes. It is. It is expensive. I will say, for all the money he makes, I'm I'm disappointed he doesn't have a factory new. You know, you know I really am. Six thousand dollar sapphire, some imperial plaid. No, Okay, so he does participate in majors. That's nice. He's got art. He must like art because I saw a couple some of these on his expensive guns. So I'm guessing that they're friends in real life, from what I can gather. Sixty-seven hundred dollar Karambit. Look at that. Five thousand dollar ruby. He got an emerald. So he obviously does spend a lot of money on this game. And he does enjoy it. Let's see how many hours he has. Uh, he, he has a private. But he has... I mean, he gets quite a, amount, quite a good amount of comments. He loves Furia. Uh, yeah, I mean... This is him. On to the next one. We have Casey Slays, which is Logic. I'm... I'm pretty sure this is logic. It was really hard to find a direct link, but after doing research, 
I'm I'm pretty sure this is it. And it makes sense because inventory private and he's kind of a private person from what I've seen him on Twitch. But I was able to do some research and he does um play CSGO with a controller. Reason being because he has a condition where a mouse and keyboard is just too much his brain can't move both at the same time so he has to use a controller with it and he's not that good I've seen clips I mean I watch him in Call of Duty once in a while and he's not you know he's not amazing but you know people like watching him I kind of enjoy watching him but I'm pretty sure this is his account there's not much you can see this is the logic group. I'm pretty sure this is the uh, official one. Uh, let's see. Yeah, I mean, I'm pretty sure this is him. I'm not a hundred percent sure, but it's he doesn't play much. He plays like once in a while, so I don't see why he would have a massive. Um, a massive inventory. He plays Call of Duty Modern Warfare mostly from every every time I've seen him stream. Now we have Captain Planet. Alright, this is oh, if I fucking forgot who this was. This was this, oh oh yeah, this is uh, one of the UFC fighters. I'll uh put it down below but so let's let's go through his inventory. You know it's only worth twelve hundred. He obviously does some investing if he buys all these souvenirs. So he has some keys. I'm not sure why he has so many keys. There's not really any point in investing in keys. Uh, you want to invest in cases. So he doesn't know much about investing. Um, let's see, where is play skins at? He's got to have some expensive looking skins. I saw a Chantico fire. Uh, yeah, this, this is another Chantico. Maybe he's investing in them? I mean... Oh, 10 year service medal. Alright. So, he's obviously been around in Steam playing CSGO for a while. And that's a lot of trash skins. So, he doesn't... It doesn't appear he has any knives or anything relatively expensive. The most expensive skin he has is a hundred and eight dollars. But I'm pretty sure him I you see I wish these celebrities would had have like their profiles private so you can actually see or not pr unprivated because you know I would like to see what games he plays what he's interested in at least he doesn't have his inventory private alright uh... Well, <laughs> oh, <laughs> this is one of his groups. Um, Mark Hunt, that's who it is. Mark, yeah. Jeez, I forgot about it. <laughs> forgot his name, but it's Mark Hunt. This is Mark Hunt's account. I don't know next. This is Joel Zimmerman, also known as Dead Mile Five. You go to his inventory; it's private. But. He he does play CS:GO occasionally. I mean, I've seen him play some PUBG before. Seen him play a little bit of CS:GO. He doesn't really um He's not very 
good, but I mean, he plays the game, he enjoys it, and he just, you know, he, he doesn't have that big of an inventory, I haven't seen that many skins, he has a few play skins, but nothing, you know, big, so, I mean, this is his, uh, this is his Steam account, or his... This is his Steam group. Alright, so as you can see, he is the leader of the Steam group. You go over there. He's offline, he doesn't play much. Because, you know, obviously he has to focus on music. Onwards, we have Jonas, which is probably the most impressive. Jonas Jablanco. Now, he owns Renegades. For Call of Duty and CSGO. Um, so, this is his Steam account. Let's see how active he is. He's pretty active. He uh, just has these Renegade stickers. He doesn't have that big of an account. I mean, it's 4000 which is about what mine is worth. But, it's not massive like Neymar's. But, he's thousand dollar knife he's a bunch of renegade stickers because you know he owns renegades as a team which I, I do like renegades good team he has a print stream he has a containment reach which is, which is one of my favorite ops he has a case card which doesn't have a special pattern I looked at it it doesn't but it seems like he, he it seems like he really likes the renegades you know the Australian this is my dream knife right here. If any of you have this, um, hit me up and we can trade, you know? Because, uh, this is really cool. Well, it's one of my dream knives. But, he does have this, which these, these are quite expensive. As you can see, 1200 almost. He has some amphibious sports gloves. He has some more amphibious crimson weave, or driver weave, I mean. Driver gloves, crimson weave. Web. Weave. Jeez. <laughs> five year vet coin so he has been playing for a while he hasn't been active though because you know work obviously because he's kind of a celebrity he is a professional player for the Golden State Warriors he lives in Sweden but he moved to the US or he lived in Sweden I believe he lives in Michigan at this point in time or right, that's where his main estate is but he travels a lot because you know he's on the Globe Trotter, or the Golden Globe, or I believe Globe Trotters. I don't know. I don't, I don't watch basketball. I watch football. But yeah, I mean, sadly, he does not have anything you can see their games play. Like none of these celebrities. I guess if that's one thing you want to learn from this is, if you can't see what games they play and how many hours, then they're probably not. <laughs> real I mean every celebrity here you can't see anything but I mean it'd be cool if you could play with one of these guys eventually you know I mean you never know maybe, maybe you run into one one last thing I do want to say is he does have an ESCA last time he played was 729 2020 uh, it, fortunately it doesn't show their level and their rank because I, you know, I don't play ESCA much. I haven't played CSGO in probably two or three weeks. So, but I wanted to get a video up for you guys. And, you know, this is, this is his account, Rebco. I mean, <laughs> uh, records, money spent 41.12 million. Current one way 50%. Highest rank A minus. So that's you know that's pretty good. I, I think when I played ESCA, I was somewhat new to CS:GO. I got a, a B minus, and I did terrible in those matches. So A minus isn't too bad. I'm sure if I actually tried in ESCA, I would get a much higher rank. History, no events, video, any videos. One before with uh, and flares of bullets. So you can't 
I can't really see that much of his inventory, but you can tell that in the past he did have a M9 case hard. So. He definitely doesn't spend that much money on skin. I wonder if if it was a blue gem or not. I'm assuming not because if you would have a blue gem, you would most likely have it on the play side. His crosshair is all right. It's a it's it's a bit beefy for me, and for most people to say the least. But he did pick a good color, which is green. I think green is the best color crosshair you can have because there's not too many colors of green in CS:GO, so it's not like you can get lost trying to find it. So as you can tell, it's, it's decent, 11 and 1, he's not amazing, but you know, he does pretty good for being a professional UFC fighter, or a professional um, basketball player, but that's it, I mean, most of these guys have been playing for a while, I mean, 16 years, 7 years, 16 years, jeez. Uh, what was this, like, five, nine? That was nine. How much is Neymar? Neymar is four. I think mine's five or six years old, but I've been playing for a while, which you can tell. They're just not impersonate our counts. Anyways, uh, thank you guys for watching. If you have any questions, let me know. If you have any video ideas, let me know. Like, comment, subscribe. Sorry for the late uploads. I've been trying to find things on CSGO to go with, and I haven't seen much of an economy change. But, have a good one.